Hey, thanks for watching this screener. I just wanted to show you real quickly um, how I created a drag and drop for um, the counties of my state. That's where Ridgeview Media is in Yavapai County in Arizona. In the United States, a lot of fourth graders, um, their history curriculum is they must learn and study the history of their state. So that was the uh, idea behind this activity or this module. The next screen I created uh, hotspots using storyline on each county name. Those yellow stars are showing the northern counties, the north central counties, um, and the southern counties and that's just a simple animation similar to PowerPoint. But anyway getting back to the hotspots. Um, I created a link to a new browser window using the hotspot to the article on Wikipedia. So uh, this, if your students are using tablets or they're doing this on their computer, they can still go out there. If you're concerned about online access, you can use either Storyline's Glossary or Resources tabs. If you use Resources, you could actually create content and save it to PDF and upload it as a, a PDF to the Resources tab. Um, the only other feature I created is I did keep the notes pane so that students could read uh, the narration script. So let me take you to the first drag and drop activity. I'm going to show this to you really quickly and then I'm going to show you uh, the scenes and storyline. This map of the state of Arizona I got from um, the state of Arizona, one of their governmental um, websites, so it's a public domain beautiful map. But anyway what I did is for the drag and drop is the target covers the name of the county. Like this one up here that I'm circling is Coconino County and so I drag it and drop it and it works. Um, what about Cochise County? I drag it over here and oops wrong. So let me try dragging Yavapai County. Oops. I got it right. So let me stop this activity and finish it so that you can see basically what your students are going to do is drag the name of each county to the target to see if they can remember geographically north, north, central, south, whatever your state is like, where the county is located. Okay, let me finish and that's right you know I just kept the generic and let me pause this the next drag and drop I created in storyline I took the first drag and drop and I just du duplicated that slide there's the feature in storyline where you duplicate and then I just changed the name the labels on these boxes from the names of the counties to the names of the county seats the city or towns where the county has its uh, governmental office. And as you can see, I moved the white target boxes down a little bit to reveal the county name. So that way your student can see Yuma County and say, oh gosh, what is the county seat of Yuma County? Well, lo and behold, it's Yuma. So let me pause so I can take you or finish this activity and take you to Storyline. Okay, let me finish this up. The state capital of Arizona is Phoenix and it's the county seat of Maricopa. And then last but not least, our beautiful town of Prescott where Ridgeview Media is located in Yavapai County. Please come visit us. We'd love to uh, show you the town. And that's right. Okay, let me stop. <coughs> Again, these are maps that I got from the internet uh, that were public domain or Creative Commons. This one is from um, the state of Arizona, actually. So let me pause and go to Storyline. Oh, there is one more slide I'll show you. Um, and then you'll see this in the Storyline project. This is basically the layout of the course. I have a scene for the introduction, a scene for the all-important drag and drops, and the acknowledgement to the folks who created the maps and then the contact me slide. Again, what I recommend you do is you create your first drag and drop and then you duplicate it to create your second activity if you have um, more than one activity. And let me move this over. I just love Storyline's um, drag and drop, um, edit drag and drop um, feature to create the interaction. It is so simple. There are plenty of tutorials. Hold on, I'll, let me pause. You can find the tutorials um, here at this tab and here's the project I worked on. Um.